An intruder. These people are under my protection. I'll not let you harm them. Hearken to my words, wicked creature. Return to the pit of evil from whence you came. Don't listen. Who knows what spells it weaves around us? Quickly, cleric. Helm. Protector of all, grant me the power to ignite this creature's flesh and burn its bones to ash. Be gone, monster. Your hag mother holds no power here. Clyde smells no lie. Then you speak truth. You fought a hag before. At ease, everyone. We may have found ourselves an ally. Forgive the paranoia. We're being hunted by a vile and wicked hag. We feared you, her minion. She's already hexed one of us, and any of us could be next. because we dared to do the impossible. We dared to fight back. You see, all of us here have fallen victim to a hag's vicious ways. But instead of succumbing to despair, we rose above it, thanks to Marina, our leader. Together, we've been helping others who've suffered at the claws of a hag. Only, Marina's been hexed by the very hag who now hunts us. You're the one that saved her. The one that ventured to the depths of Ethel's lair. I can hardly believe it. You look so... normal. By Helm, perhaps there is hope. If anyone can help Marina, it's you. She's upstairs. But be warned. She's not as you remember her. Tread careful. <laughs> Where am I needed? Two steps at a time. Fine. <laughs> 
You removed my hex. Ah, uh, that's annoying. I wanted to play a little longer. Auntie likes her toys broken. She's not going to be happy I had to get my hands dirty. I don't matter. Only Auntie does. They want to hurt Auntie. They have the book. I will die before I let anyone touch a hair on her head. Huh. You have no idea how wrong you are. I have worshipped her for decades past, and will for decades more. fault. Mayrina was hexed mere days after the Dragonborn joined us. Why didn't I see it? Mayrina was right about you. Thank you for saving her when I couldn't. That lying, thieving, scaly little shit! Thanks for knifing the bastard. That makes twice you've saved me. I'm starting to think you're my guardian angel. You too. I've come a long way since we last met. Decided I was sick and tired of feeling stupid, helpless. So I decided I wasn't gonna be a victim anymore. This group is made of survivors. People like me who've been hurt by hags. I brought them together to fight back. We trapped a hag to the city, but lost her trail. Right after she snatched a little girl. <sighs> what hag doesn't? Best guess says it's close to where the mother lives, but I've no hard evidence. The moment I started investigating the missing girl, I felt the hag's eye on me. Next thing I was sprouting wool and bleating up a storm. Thank you. With you at our side, that hag won't know what hit her. Check the safe in the back. I've done my homework on Hag since we last tangled with Ethel. Take whatever you need. I know it by heart anyway. Laura was knocking about Basilisk Gate at the Flaming Fist's headquarters. Good luck. Glad can Easy panic. Let things happen when Glad panics. Of course, madam. Let me just... <sighs> Forgive me, why are you here? Is this some kind of sick joke? Do you have any idea what I've been through these past few days? Oh, 
Yes. Her name is Vanra. <laughs> this stupid, useless fist said she had a lead, but she must have been stuck in dream mist or something. Madam, tell me. You said... <laughs> she was... <laughs> Taken from a tavern? You catch the barest tendrils of magic coiled around the flaming fist. Yes, the blushing mermaids down by the docks I told you a hundred times. Why aren't you listening? Someone or something has tampered with her memory. What, um... What were we discussing? has happened to her. Her name is Vanra. She's seven years old and has red hair, like me. We were in the Blushing Mermaid when she was taken. Just up by the docks. Thank you. I'll head home. Can't stumble being around these idiots any longer. Come find me the moment you hear anything. hung over in peace. Oh. Why, hello there. Captain Grizzly at your service. What can I do for a long drink of water like yourself? Oh, not this claptrap again. Listen. Laura was here, all right? Knocking back pints like there's no tomorrow. But she was alone. I saw head nor ass of this so-called kid. And when we tried to kick her out, she pulled a knife on my front man. Bet she didn't tell you that bit, huh? I run a bar. What use would I have with some little one running around, crying and shitting? Look, I know Laura from my pirating days. She ran with Bart Blackdagger's crew. Heard they tossed her overboard when she gutted the bosun over a game of cards. Now, I'd no beef with her before this. All are welcoming the maid. But threatening my staff, claiming we took her kid, she's bonkers. <laughs> Dangerous. Next time she pulls a knife on me and mine, someone might die. Something has to be done. There's one way and one way only to shut someone up. She's dangerous. And I couldn't call myself a captain if I stood by and did nothing. I hate that it's come to this. But I'll pay a hoard of gold to whoever scuppers her. Permanently. Oh. 
You're no fun. <laughs> I wanted you to stain your soul with the blood of an innocent mother. Oh, well. Yes, I'll just decorate the room with your insides. They'll match my new carpet beautifully. Hello, Petal. Miss me? <laughs> Did you think you were the first? That I didn't plan for it, Petal? Marina ran off with the child I was promised. Because of you. So I had to find myself a new one. And little Vanra was so very tasty. I'm already showing. Doesn't it suit me so well? Vanra sits in my belly, growing fat with power. In time, I'll vomit her up and have myself a fresh young hag to train. Unfortunately, that leaves me in a pickle. For a while, I'd love to rip your guts out. I shouldn't. Exertion is bad for the baby, you know. So, walk away. Walk away and let me a fine hag make. Or what? You'll kill me? Touch me and the girl dies. And I'll simply return. Stronger than ever. A woman in my condition should be relaxing in the bath, not dealing with this nonsense. I'll leave you to my crew, matey. And should you somehow survive, stay away, or Van will suffer. Marks of a hag's lair. Trump. showed up. I told you, Petal, you can't hurt me without killing little Zandra. I'll have your feet, so do the heroic thing. 
Did you stay down, Vagra? No, stay down. Everything is going to be all right. You brought her back. You brought back my sweet, sweet girl. I doubt I'll ever sleep again. For fear she'll be smite from under my nose. Here. A token from the pirate life I left behind. Thank you for being braver than half this city put together. You hungry, sweet girl? Mm. How about we bake something? You love baking. Remember? Mm. She's dead, isn't she? Ethel is dead. Yes! Fuck you, Ethel, you miserable old bat! Fuck you for telling me I'd be an awful mom. That I was nothing but a pregnant half-wit. Oh, and the girl? You saved her too, right? Oh, thank the gods! Oh, they say revenge doesn't fix anything, but damn does it feel amazing. Thank you.
Of course. Here. Because of you, I'll finally be able to sleep with both eyes shut. Thank you. You'll be born any day now. I can't wait to meet you. It's a good feeling. We're finally free from Ethel. Thanks to you. I can't wait to start living again.